How's it going everyone? My name is Seaglass and today we'll be completing Humanitarian Supplies. A peacekeeper task where he gives you a laundry list of objectives to complete, all while sporting the fashionable and incredibly not camouflaged blue untar armor on shoreline. So let's jump right into it. Peacekeeper wants you to mark two lost UN cargo trucks with the MS-2000 marker we've all grown to love. Find and deliver five MRE ration packs and kill 10 scavs on shoreline while dressed in a UN uniform. The Untar armor vests and helmet can be purchased off the flea market for an okayish amount. I bought both items for around 60k. You can also acquire these items in a trade with Ragman as well. Three max energy drinks can get you the armor vest from Ragman level 2, and two anti-fragmentation glasses can get you the helmet also from Ragman level 2. While wearing both your sporty blue helmet and vest, jump into Shoreland and start marking the cargo trucks and kicking scav butt. The first truck I marked is located behind the blue fence on the road towards the customs extraction, directly under the crane. Once you place the marker, you'll need to wait 30 seconds. So find a safe spot or hightail it back to the tree line and wait out the time. The second cargo truck can be found in the health resort on the north side of the sanatorium compound as soon as you enter the area. Again, plant the marker and wait your 30 seconds. If you haven't already, top off your remaining scav kills. A good place to check is the weather station, where there's usually a healthy amount of scavs hanging out. As a consolation prize, the weather station also has a safe, a computer, and a smorgasbord of filing cabinets for you to search. But there should be no shortage of scavs on shoreline, so kill them anywhere you see fit. The last task objective is to find and deliver 5 MRE ration packs. These don't need to be found in raids, so you can buy them straight off the flea market and turn them in if you're impatient like I was. As a reward for completing the task, you will receive 800 American dollars, as well as unlocking the purchase of a Hexagon AK-74 545 suppressor from Skier Level 2. Well guys, that's it for this quest. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe down below. And if you'd like any other videos made, let me know in the comment section as well. Also, don't forget to check out our live streams on Twitch. Take care, everyone.